right page, you trigger-happy madman. It's a person. Very well. I'm afraid you've fallen down the wrong rabbit hole, But beggars can't be true. Hmm? So let's make a deal. You help us, and you don't die. A win-win, yeah? Not such you have much choice. Back off, Doc. Hey, kid. But listen, this place has gone to hell. It's getting worse fast. Richtofen is stepping up to repair our teleportation device, but it's not going to be an easy job. You find us and provide some support, and you might actually make it out of here. The speck of good news in all this is that there are still some supplies scattered around this dump. Get yourself armed and maybe mow down an undead ugly or two on the way over. A broken clock is right twice a day, yes? Well, that is German and his plan. Consider it the first correct strike of day. As a doctor, I'm afraid it is my duty to break bad news. By passing through the rift, your world has been affected by the ether. Ether energy has the power to tear open the seams of the multiverse itself, allowing humans and objects to shuttle in and out of time and space. Our coming here was purely by accident. automatically attack. Just don't put the turret outside the defensive umbrella. They can't stand the storm. Listen to me carefully. At night, the bases will attract no end of dangerous creatures. If it is destroyed, we'll be torn to pieces by the storm in seconds. Bastards are here, guns are loaded. Let's get this started. Transmission device is almost repaired. You'd better collect more supplies and meet back here before nightfall so we can prepare. 
I sense the salvage we've gathered from several scattered vehicles your way. Use it wisely. Running vehicles are rare commodities. And should you happen to use one, exercise caution. The ether storm paralyzes motors when night falls, because of course they do. Kid, you can't die here. They're almost there. If the etheric energy is raging at night, it should be able to provide enough energy to help us reopen the portal. As for you, I'm afraid if you don't make it back on time, we won't wait for you. Don't let poor punctuality be your downfall. like an honest, yet simple-minded sort of person, so do enjoy. Today, I will provide you with more defensive turrets. In addition, I'm sending you my latest turret design. You may look over the blueprints for more details. Upgrading the original turret should help it endure more of those creatures. Do not be stingy with bullets either. Let them rain down like hellfire. Loading! Cover me! Now that was a fight! Try to dogpile us when the sun's down and run scared the minute it comes up, will ya? The friggin' cowards! This is not that complicated! Just look at the vortex! When the etheric energy rages at night, transmission cracks open, when these monsters are then attracted by the energy! Like raccoons drawn to the dumpster! But these are infinitely more fun to blow up. Reloading! Cover me! Your turret's under attack. Fix them before they're lost. Still in the same damn place. Do you think I don't know that, Gipsy? The energy in this space is too strong. It's sucking us in place like candy. We need to harness more of that energy ourselves to break through this barrier. Ah, I see broken clock kicks off. Cover me. 
almost forgot. There is also a large warehouse where you can share supplies with your teammates. In my homeland, unity is our virtue, so be generous. Leave extra materials in public warehouse for your teammates to use. Cover me. Reloading. I'm going to need some time on this, so I suggest making good use of your new equipment. The teleportation setting is active, but the etheric energy accumulation will attract more enemies. I've broken the eggs. It's up to you to clean it up. through now. Get ready, soldier. This is gonna be a big one. Portal is open! Men, they are going home! 